Hello everyone, this is me, Real Dark Storm here with some Call of Duty Black Ops 2 multiplayer gameplay and I already know that we're lagged so bad so I'm just going to give it a couple seconds to warm up and we're good to go so one of these, this is the map that runs pretty well on my computer actually so I can actually record playing on this map so it drops the frame rate ah <sighs> man uh, of course my computer specs um, I will probably put down in the description below probably um, but I'll tell you the name of the computer so you can look it up just in case it's called a HP Stream 11 and it is a low-end notebook not really meant for gaming but I'm gaming on it anyways mm -hmm. and we got that guy and we got a kill with the grenade nice so go for the game Cold beef, we there. Sticky. I always got that kill. Oh, I got D6. So, guys, right now we're getting 20 to 30 average frame rate when in combat. But I'm gonna do a benchmark starting right now, so I won't be able to see my frame rate as I'm doing the benchmark. And I will list down the average frame rate, the minimum frame rate, and the max frame rate of this game. Friendly hunter killer drone deployed. Um, uh, what I recommend you guys get Black Ops 2 on your low end computer, depending on the specs. This computer is basically it's at the verge of bad performance on, and good down. performance. So, shooter down. Um, I would recommend getting Black Ops 2 if you have the same specs as this computer or something similar. Changing. But Black Ops 2 is playable on this computer. Anyways, I gotta have some exciting news today, guys. Exciting news, as a matter of fact. And someone took the first care of it, god damn it. Um, I have Black Ops 3, this multiplayer starter pack. So I will be doing some Black Ops 3 multiplayer gameplay soon with low end configurations, of course. And I can't wait to see if I can get Black Ops 3 to run. Because I'm very excited to play Black Ops 3. Like, people have been saying Black Ops 3 is bad because how it is like today, of course. But I think that Black Ops 3 is a good game and doing some nice content. Um, Black Ops 2, of course, plays the best and, um, FPS game ever made to exceed Black Ops. Black Ops 3 kind of... And I always got knife, but I got shot anyways. Okay. We're getting some nice frame rate. It's really easy to shoot, actually. Sticky out. Come on. Oh, that knife. That was pretty lucky, actually. Nah, I ain't gonna lie. Timeline in jeopardy. Pick it up. Uh, went around circles. The trick is to do what your opponent, well, not to do what your opponent expects, of course. Got a scanner right there. Cool. Friendly UAV inbound. And I died from a grenade. No, someone shot me to death. Never mind. Damn. Um, I'm gonna upload this stuff, but anyways, yep, Block of Three. Um, kind of gameplay coming very soon. I just gotta buy me a USB Google flash drive that has 64 gigabytes of storage on it. Cause I only have a 32 gigabyte SD card and Black Ops 3 uses 34 gigabytes. <sighs> Man, I had to wait for like a few days. Um, hopefully I can buy it soon. Um, I won't be online or even recording tomorrow cause I got some problems I gotta deal with. Not like technical problems, just problems about people annoying people <sighs> so yeah guys um hope you guys actually yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this gameplay um i will link down below some stuff but um i'm gonna do an update too this dude is a little bit confusing and sorry for the late content anyways peace out guys and i hope you enjoy and sub and like and comment down below if you want Need to do a video on how to improve Black Ops 2 performance with a custom configuration that 
will make sure the game is at its lowest. See you guys later.